Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another exciting adventure of what I do. And what I do is I'm in Fallout. Anyways, my name is Mr. Chalupa Monkey. I hope you have a delicious, delectable beverage with you today. Shut up, Niner! No! Okay, enough of that. Well, my name is Mr. Chalupa Monkey. This is Niner, Radroach, Mr. Peppers, uh, Cyan, Cactus, and Veronica's over there in the corner. We've had some occurrences of what we've heard is vampire zombie cows. Someone's been feeding zombie cows in the area. Oh, hey, Cass. Anyways. Oh. Brahmin. They've been feeding Brahmin meat chunks. We have to stop this disease. Oh. Only way I know how. Explosives. Let's go find some people who might have been feeding these poor Brahmin meat, slowly turning them into meat hungry monster cows. Cow. So, yeah, we're back in the world of Fallout New Vegas. As I said, I'm going to make this one at least closer to 30 minutes. Um. If I go over, that's okay. No big deal. Dip, 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 dip. Yum. So, still with the same guys. Niner, Radroach, uh, Cass, Mr. Peppers, Veronica, and my junkie over there. Uh, Cyan, I think that's her name? Meh. But yeah, the only reason I keep uh, Cass around is because uh, I think she's cute. And... Veronica, she's a workbench. Niner's Niner. Roach is awesome. Mr. Peppers is adorable. I love you, Mr. Peppers. I love you. Uh, Cayenne. Yeah, she's okay. You're a workbench. That's all you are to me. Just kidding. You're nice, too. You punch stuff. Hmm. Could this possibly be what I'm thinking? I know you might say, why the hell do you have that many 40 Mike Mike grenades? Well, believe it or not, I found a bunch of f dead people with this many grenades on them, so it was a lot of grenades. Uh, oh, there we go. Thank you. Looks like someone didn't hide their stuff good enough. All right. I'm not a junkie. I can stop anytime I want. Look. Alright. It's not my fault. I can stop anytime I want. I don't need it. See? I'm not drinking any. Give me that fruit. Come on. Where are these people? They're supposed to be, uh... Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't know. There's supposed to be someone in this area. I'm thinking. Hello? People? From what I've heard, zombie cows, mad cow disease, battle cattle, anybody? Come on. There's got to be somewhere around here. Hey look, a tiny shack. Anybody? Anyone? We're gonna go in... Well, I should probably not enter a building with a grenade launcher. Uh, let's see. 10 millimeter submachine gun. That's good enough to clear a room, right? Yeah? Yes, no? Anyone? Broken handset radio. Get out of my way. Anything empty. Hmm. Whoever was here cleared out in a hurry. There's not even pictures on the wall. Except for that one. That one's broken. They couldn't even take the frame. They just took the picture. Alright. Maybe the people making vampire... Whoa. Nope. 
Incoming! We got contact! There! Oh, I almost hit a friendly. Thank goodness I missed. Where are you, you ugly- There! Ha <laughs> ha! Explosions in your face are always good, right? Oh, man. Did I get them all? Works for me. Spoils the war. Mm. Oh, and the thick red paste is actually a healing item you can get from your survival, if you get your survival skill high enough. So, I, I was actually questioned, what is thick red paste? And thick red paste is good. Oh. Ye, I did not know waste west side military, but ye I wish was okay. Amen. Give me your stuff. Let's put you somewhere where you'll have some dignity and rest in peace. Uh ah, couch. There you go. Ugh, God, you're heavy. Okay, just, just relax. Just, hey, calm, calm down. Okay, almost. No, that's, that's not how you sit in a couch. Just get on the couch. Fly with me. Good enough. Let's float down. She, uh... She fell down the stairs and um, broke her neck. Yeah, that's that's about right. What happened over here? Oh, not another one. Oh, you guys didn't stand a chance. I'm sorry. I'm not taking your clothes, bro. It's terrible. All these people, poor people are just dying left and right. Gosh darn shame, that's what it is. Gosh darn shame. Gosh darn shame, that's what it is. Eh. Mm. Marksman rifle, yeah. So if things get hairy, we can get scary. <laughs> that, was a, that was a pretty bad rhyme. But yeah, hopefully you guys, um, you can hear everything okay. I did play with my levels if the game seems a little quiet. Um, hi. You hear there was some kind of shootout at one of them casinos on the strip? Some people got killed or something. Yeah, I know. I, I was, um, shooting people. Going to place me a good bet at the thorn. Okay. Ooh, you look like a rough and tumble gentleman. Hmm. <laughs> I see a lot of folks come and go, but none fit your type. Where you come from, stranger? <laughs> Relax, I'm only here to ask some questions. I'm just another wasteland wanderer. Why the such suspicion? Because that's the law of the land. You never know when someone's going to stab you in the back. And I like mine upright. Maybe one day, stranger, when you've seen all I've seen, done all I've done, you'll sooner trust a rad scorpion than a new face in the wasteland. Jeez, man, you got yourself some, uh, trust issues. I see you take care of yourself. Your ball trigger seems. Hmm. Shines like silver. You got a sharp eye on you. I take it you like guns, huh? Yes, Question I do. Question is, can you handle more than just a weapon? Of course, I can handle more than I just mean, a weapon. I mean, you've got to know yourself before you can truly know the gun. So let's see it, stranger. Do you know yourself? We see eye to eye. We speak warrior to warrior. And I thought myself too old to find an equal. <laughs> Listen, warrior. There are two kinds of folks. You load your gun like an ordinary man, or you load it like a devil. We ain't ordinary, are we? See, I pack good brass up with slow-burning powder, then cap it with a heavy semi-wide cutter bullet. 
That's how you make 44 ammo that'll put the fear of the heavens on any wasted that dare cross your path. See, that's actually really nice, but I pack an explosive warhead on top of a slow burning powder inside a 44 mic grenade canister in a tube of death. Tube of death. <laughs> that's a long one, stranger. Let's just say I got tired of killing in the wasteland, and now I found a better home for my old butt. Cool. So what did you hear? Outer Vegas ain't exactly a safe place. Despite our numbers, the wasteland creeps through every nook and cranny. I make sure any dangers to the people of North Vegas stay outside Note our self. barrier, stranger. I go buy a Day and night, revolver. I stand watch. We're independent for... There are a bunch of lunatics... Mm -hmm. You heard me. We don't like those stiff back, clean hand little pussies. New Vegas belongs to the people. The NCR is just a corrupt and bloated monster no better than any other wasteland crawler. We make this land wealthy, and we ain't giving it up. You make sense, sir. The sweat of your brow is what you get to keep. Now that's a reference to another game, if you get what I mean, but um Vault 3's fiend territory. Those shitheads attack West Side all the time, even making it to the rest of Outer Vegas when they crawl under the sewers. Wow, looks like I'm gonna have to go down in the sewers. You clean that vermin's nest? Gotta say, we don't see that kind of attitude around here. Good work. Hmm. What's eating? Eh. So long, warrior. See you, bud. Oh, by the way. Blackheart, 44 Magnum. Yeah. This place looks pretty messed up. Where are you going? Going to eat the next fucking rat I see. If you're that hungry, I'll just give you something. Can I help you with something, stranger? We've been here for a few years, just looking for a place we can call our own. Life's harsh, but still, it beats the hell out of the desert. We've got numbers, we've got food, and we've got trade. That's progress, stranger. Keep your nose to the ground, stranger, that's what. Mind your own business and let us mind our own. Are we clear? If you've got a mind to loot the old H&H &H tools factory, don't even bother. That place is sealed tighter than a rad scorpion's bunghole. Jesus. Every salvager who tries gets blown up flattened or gutted by traps then he starts to stink up the town and we're the ones to clean up the mess name's crandon stranger i keep an eye out for trouble around here nice to meet you crandon what kind of trouble folks that don't belong murderers rapists extortionists and everything in between so you're like an outback you sheriff know. business as usual in north vegas stranger ncr you're not very uh NCR is not very liked in this area, even though these are NCR. Careful with those fiends in the western sewers. Hmm. There's one building that's not all wrecked. Won't have to worry about those fiend assholes for some time now, huh? Let's see what we can do in the sewers. Apparently, there's a bunch of fiends floating around. I'm gonna shoot one in the face. Turn on the light, pull out our gun. Let's do this, guys. Mr. Peppers, out of the way. Hello? Michelangelo? Donatello? Leonardo? Where's the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles when you need them? Hey, bud. Going to stay down here until all the trouble outside blows over. You guys look friendly. You hear there was some kind of shootout at one of them casinos on the strip? Some people got killed or something. Howdy. Uh. I hear the Great Khans got massacred again. No survivors this time, though. How did the Great Khans get massacred? I didn't shoot them yet. Hmm. Let's not go up. Let's keep exploring the sewers, people. We might find a way over to the fiends, if you know what I mean. Uh, oh. 
Oh, the water's ready. Can't help thinking that we've not seen the last of the fiends yet. Want to see the best of New Vegas? Our sewers got it. The thorn. So I hear the honcho of one of them strip families up and disappear. Yeah, we'll find oh, it's radiated. Get out of here. Hey, Sixy, you ever been to Denver? Strange place. Everyone no, Niner, I have not been up to Denver. Jesus. And even if I did, do you think I'd be remember? I've been shot in the face. Twice. Ah, the thorn. I hear reports of Legion raiding parties all over the place. Come to see the fights? Or Red Lucy? Dude, you have some crazy chops. But stay away from Red Lucy. She's mine. <laughs> no, literally. I, I laid stake to that. Welcome back, stranger. Hey there, Lucy. How you doing? Um, can I take part in Thorn? What do you... My creatures are expensive to find. If your pleasure is to see them bleed at your will, those costs will change. I'll help you set up good matches. You pay, you bet, and I bring you the most delightful spectacle on this world. I'm gonna set the next You're match. paying for it. What'll bleed today in the thorn, stranger? Uh. Hmm. Ooh. A night stalker. How many? Just two. What'll fight on blue? <laughs> Giant. The thorn's thirsty for blood. Here's the money. You got it. Best of luck. I gotta see this. Yes. Yes. Two night stalkers versus a family of scorpions. Come on, guys. Let's see you fight to death. Yeah, come on. Oh. Oh, man. What? That's it? It's time for blood, not talk. Find me after the fight. Fight's over, honey. It's time for blood, not talk. Find me after the fight. Is that it? That was, that's cool, I guess. Well done, stranger. Here's your share. Sweet. I got a nice share of money. Alright, well, that's... I guess the wasteland version of dog fighting. I don't condone dog fighting whatsoever, so don't think I do. Dog fighting is not a thing in my book. Considering I got a cute little pit bull myself. She's such a little precious, she's not right. She's asleep on my bed. <laughs> Anyways, ladies and gentlemen. Question to the audience out there. If you could live in the Fallout world, what would you do? What would your hobbies be? Would you be a bounty hunter? Would you be a raider? Go ahead and leave me a comment down in the description. Or, not the description. <laughs> leave me a comment in the comment box. And yes, I would start up a Taco Bell and call it the Wasteland Taco Bell. <laughs> It'd be fun. Whoa. Whoa, where are we? Hello? Oh, hi. Um, who are you? Masha Fabish. Nice to meet you, Masha Fabish. My pleasure is on my. Goodbye. Goodbye. Sounds like someone might have cut you, buddy. Hmm. Apparently there's a garden over here. I think there's people in this area. I didn't... Maybe there's a few missions. Let's see if we can get some missions out of this place. Hey, you. Do you have some info? If there's war in nope. the end, it won't affect our city. I have a feeling that there's, like, an important person to talk to, and he's going to stand out. Mark my words. Won't be if Caesar's dead, why ain't the NCR taking care of regular folks yet? 
Listen, Caesar's long from dead. I killed him. NCR should head back to their lands. I'm sure their people miss them. I'm pretty sure their people miss them. Well, that's a possible. Yes, that's. Hello? There's a spark. I have a spark. I'm keeping that. Can we drink from that? Oh no, that wouldn't be good to drink from. Why is that? That water's deadly as crap, but that water's okay to drink. Oh well. I don't care. Getting some water. Maybe they never clean that water out. Ah, it's good to stay hydrated. Hmm. Ah. Okay. Had to had to parch my lips. I'm sorry. Here, the NCR and the Kings have been getting along. It's good news for Freeside. Hmm. I feel that there's something important here. I just don't know what. If I find a build, oh well, let's see if we can go into here. Hmm. Bob's Liquors. <laughs> that actually reminds me of a place somewhere in here. Hey, Bob. Howdy. Name's Bob, but folks around here call me Klamath Bob. What can I do you for? <laughs> yeah, good old Klamath. Not a bad place if you like hunting, eating, and skinning geckos all day. <laughs> It's a pretty dull place, but I hear there was a bit of excitement when this tribal from Arroyo came to town years back. All before my time, though. I might have some answers for you. What did you want to know? I run the liquor store on West Side. With things this rough, some folks need a lot of booze just to step out of the door in the morning. After mm. I close up shop, I walk around and help keep the peace. Not that I'm good with a gun, mind you, but someone's got to do it, you know? Well, things aren't great here, but I've seen a lot worse. We've got the fiends to the south of us, and that ain't good. The scorpions hang out at the Monte Carlo when they aren't slinging chems or getting their heads blown off by the fiends. Probably the best thing we've got going on is the co-op, run by Mr. Etienne. Get some help from the followers of the apocalypse, I think. That's cool. What's with the scorpions? Not much to tell. Typical gang of dumb bullies and angry nobodies. They're holed up a bit south of here, in the Monte Carlo suites. They think they're tough. But any time they tangle with the fiends, they get torn right up. Hmm. Good to know. Not so much lately. The NCR is giving them hell any time they poke their damn heads out. Bless those boys and gals for getting rid of that vermin. I feel pity for any man or woman that gets addicted to chems. But when they prey on decent folk, well, then it's time to put them down. Listen, buddy. You better watch your words carefully. I like my liquor, but I'm not preying on innocent people. I work for my caps. Food from the people <laughs> and for the people. Anyone, locals got. All right, yeah, yeah. What else did you want to check? What do you know, super mutant? Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's mean son of a bitch. I know the name sounds bad, but he likes it. He's one nasty old coot. Far as I can tell, he's one of them original super mutants. What came from the boneyard? Wandered about after that master fellow died. Eventually got caught somewhere around the hub back in NCR. Boy, they sure treated him mean down there. Cut him up so bad he can't talk no more. I tried to buy him just so they'd stop hurting him, but they didn't want any of it. Hmm. Man, that means the NCR is intolerant to mutants. I don't know who I've been working for this entire time. He just showed up here one day. Couldn't really talk, but he remembered me all right. Ever since then, he's just been, well, hanging around, I guess. Does odd jobs for folks and smashes the bad guys when they come broken around. Cool. Some folks steer clear of him for sure, but you don't seem to mind. Turns out some of them night kids, whatever you call those sneaky super mutant types, got in and busted him out. I guess somebody named Tabitha led the bunch that freed him. Don't know much more than that. Oh, I know Tabitha. All right, well. What else did? Sure. So what you got for sale there, All bud? right, then. Hopefully I've got something to wet your whistle. Wow, bud. If you're living in the ghetto, you sure swimming in caps. Uh, I don't need that. Let's see. What else can I sell you? I don't need them cat size. Danny boy apples. I don't need all this dirty water. 
Do you have anything else you might want? Let's go down the bottom. Man, I got 12 whiskeys? Jesus. And Wasteland Tequila. I don't need vodka. Let's see what you got. Hmm. <gasps> hmm. Milk bottle, pack of cigarettes. Take your scrap metal. Let's see. Yeah. Oh. I don't know why I collect these, but I do. That's good enough. Thanks, bub. Okay. I'm gonna take a look around your store. Oh. Uh, your thing fell off. I'm just putting it back for you. Uh, yeah. You guys got to be more careful around this crap. Jeez, really. Have more respect for this man's business. Mm. Is your sign really blinking? Oh, well. Where is it? Nothing like a little bit of scotch to make your day. All right, let's go. Nothing too important here. Hey, kiddo, what's going on? You want some candy? Oh, hello. I deliver things and stuff for the people here. They give me caps to do it. Hey, I'm glad to see you're Bye. doing some honest work, kiddo. Is that your Brahmin? Are you going to grow up and be a caravaner? <gasps> He's got a future. That kid's going places. <laughs> that kid is doing stuff. What the? Who are you? Why are you talking to me, man? I'm trying to relax here. Got it? Oh, whoa, whoa. Me and Dermot work salvage around New Vegas. What do you even mean? He's Dermot. Dermot knows how to work salvage better than any man I ever met. Doesn't go asking questions all day, neither. Fuck off. I don't like you, sir. And Mr. Peppers doesn't like you either. I got nothing you need. If it's ass you're looking for, talk to pretty Sarah. Me and my partner, St. James, work salvage around well. Yeah. I'll put my eye on you guys. Let's see. I don't like them. I hear the Hi there. Welcome to the Westside Co-op. I'm Clayton Etienne. Let me know if you have any questions. Yes, I got some questions. Wait, what do you have for sale? All right. Oh, he sells food. Sweet. I'm gonna need all those. You know, it's not like I'm collecting blue sunsets, dark ass blue caps. I need them. I mean, no, I, no, I'm not doing nothing. Pleasure doing business with you. Tell me about the. It might not look like much, but it's what keeps us West Side locals independent. We started it a few years ago. I admit we had a lot of trouble at first, but eventually we got some help. From We're finally to the point where the co-op members can start making money from sales instead of just breaking even. That's cool. See you later. Later there, pal. Maybe you can... Uh... Welcome back. How can I help you? Oh, that's... Mm. Yeah, don't... We're hunting don't mind me. Heads. Don't mind me. Okay, you got nothing suspicious on you. Oh, um, it looks like, uh, your safe is a, is a little, um... Oh, shit. Um... Yeah, your safe looks like it, it has a leak in it. Whoa. Sorry there, bub. I don't know what that was, but we will find out. Alright guys, let's go outside. <laughs> Sorry there, bub, but you know, you're, um... What? Oh my good god. Oh my goodness. I'm keeping this. I don't care what no one says. That's... That's um... That's, that's mighty fine apparel I got there. <laughs> Sorry bub. You, you
Welcome to the Casa Madrid. If you get an itch need scratching, you came to the right place. Just watch how you treat the merchandise. Oh, so you... who's the merchandise? Three flavors to choose from. Sweetie, Maud, and Jimmy. Sweetie's the house favorite, for reasons that should be obvious. Maud is what you might call the discount rack. She's what a customer wears if he doesn't have the caps to afford Sweetie. Or just like some old. Oh. Jimmy's more of a specialist. I only hear good things. I... uh... Most of my body is scarred all over, like a ghoul. Nobody around who'd want to screw that. No, I just run things. Did I really click on that? We don't talk about that. Next topic. I look after the only reasons anyone would want to spend any time here. I'm a pimp. All Marco does is collect rent and take a small cut of my action. He sure as hell doesn't clean the rooms. You know where... Wow, you are badly burned. I'm sorry, lady. I don't know what could have happened, but maybe you'll feel better. Oh, by the way, I'm breaking into this house. Don't care, don't know. Oh, look. Maybe this guy was cooking meth. I'll take your 12 gauge rounds. Nothing here that I care about. Get out of my way. Okay. Anything in here? Hello? No. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No. I thought that was a magazine. Six, I'm bored. Shut up, Niner. We're breaking into places. I never said I was a good guy. I'm just the dude spy. getting stuff done. Go first. Anything hey. else? No. Nope. Hey, Nothing. Um, let's just check it. Nah. Nothing of interest. Alright, just making sure we're not missing nothing. Hello? Okay. Hello? Room service! Hey, bub. Tom Anderson, can I help you? I'm with the followers of the apocalypse, and I help the locals in Westside grow crops. Mm. Unlike the NCR, the followers don't expect anything back. Oh, that's the nice. The soil and the hot, dry environment don't make it easy. But we get by all right. We've even got our own food store, the West Side Co-op. Oh, that's cool. Um, have you seen any suspicious activity around here? You know, like, um, I don't know. What qualifies as suspicious activity in the wasteland? <gasps> teddy bear! <gasps> oh, teddy bear! Huh. Oh, man, if you guys can hear what I can hear in the background, you... You'd see Oh, someone tried to kill themselves with a toaster in the bathtub. Oh, it sounds like someone's really going at it upstairs. Uh, even in the future, people are at it. <laughs> well, what can you expect? It's a nuclear apocalypse. Just as long as the walls aren't paper thin. And I hate to say it, you know. If <laughs> people go at it no matter what. I just as long as your walls aren't paper thin. Jesus Christ, could you put a gag in that woman? <laughs> Hello, anyone here? You guys making meth? This isn't I'm in a meth lab. I should put a hazard mask on. I feel that there's something here that's important. Just too many locked doors. Too many secrets. Secrets are bad. Anything? Nothing? No one? Someone's gonna be mad they're gonna show up. Hello? Anything new happening? Nope! I do not want to even touch you. I'm gonna look through your fridge. You are a hooker. You know what? Fine. Hey baby, what say you and me get acquainted? Let's... let's not. I bring in the customers and she makes sure no one gets rough. Sarah's good people. Good enough, anyway. I got my start at the Gomorra. Good money, but I saw how those Omeras hook girls on free jet or medex, then start charging. Slavery through a needle is what that is. I earn less out here, but I keep more. Mm, I guess you do. Anyways, see ya. You know you'll be back. Um, no I won't, because, um, goodbye. Oh. 
Hello, stranger. Jesus Christ! For no, no, no! <laughs> Goodbye. Wait. Drugs? There's something here, and I know it. There's something hiding deep in this place. I bet you it's in one of those hooker rooms. Uh, some things are not right here. What's in your fridge? Who knows what you Someone your finally put down that sick motor runner, son of a bitch. Good riddance. Talking to people. Let's see what you Hey, want. mister, looking to relax? Looks like you carry a lot of tension in your shoulders. And upper thighs. Whoa! Whoa! Well, back ribs are especially of mine. Maybe I'll show you something. Hmm. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I think I'd like that. A lot. Maybe even give you a discount for my company. Listen, Bell. No thank you. Uh, I hear you were a slave for season. Please. Baby, who I am doesn't matter. I'll be anybody you need me to be. Oh, gross. It's better that way. You'll see. No. No, it's not, Bell. No, it's not. How much for your service? Have you been working here long? Half a year or so. The cost is a dump and Marco's a pig, but pretty Sarah makes sure I don't get hassled. I don't get as many customers as Sweetie or Maud, but the customers I do get always come back. That's good to know. Um. See you. Yeah. I'm gonna go over here now. I guess there was nothing in this place. You hear there was some kind of shootout at one of them casinos on the strip? Some people got killed or something. You sound so concerned about people getting killed. It's the wasteland. Everyone gets off. Whatever. I guess there was nothing here to begin with. Maybe I was just too suspicious because there's people here. What? Huh. Um. Oh well. Maybe I can find another place to go into. Some assholes outside. Where were they? Those guys over there, but... Uh, it's getting late, ladies and gentlemen. Getting late indeed. Ooh, they're playing checkers! Have you seen so the one of the trips that lit up and disappeared? You can see it from miles. What? Yeah, they'll find his body someday. We can go in here? It's a pawn shop. Nice! Usually you can find good stuff at a pawn shop. Hey there, bub. If you're down on your luck and need some caps, I'd buy just about anything. Of course, I've also got plenty of things for sale, too. Let's see what you got for sale. Of course. Oh, you got some ammo. Had some decent weapons. Nice. I got stuff for sale, too, there, buddy boy. There, take this. I don't need it. And that. That's a unique weapon, so I'm not losing that. Zap glove. Blah. Who needs it? Mm -hmm. Take one. Let's see what you got. Leather armor. Uh, I might need to fix my metal helmet. Yes, I'm still wearing the helmet, ladies and gentlemen. Still wearing the helmet. 308. I'm gonna just buy all your ammo. Oh, I need those. And give me your five, five, six all the point. I'm down with that. All right. Wait, no, no, no. Yes. All right. Peace. But another satisfied. I still feel like West Side is just—it's getting along too well for people for it to. Oh wait, loading match. Apparently we can break down 45 ammo or it's like some special whatever. Sweet. Alright. Cool. I was just making ammo. 
Wow. This this has already gone over 40 minutes, guys. Um that tower on the strip, the one you can see for miles. I hear it ain't sealed up no more. Yeah, it's it's not, but um we're going to go ahead and uh call it a night. Yep, this sounds good. You guys, watch my back. I'm going to bed. Anyways, guys, until next time, peace, love, and chicken grease. See you next time in the wasteland. I still got my metal helmet on. If I can spin this camera. Still got my metal helmet on. And we're going to hit the sack. All right, guys. Night, night. Goodbye.